This is Louise for MMA Crazy TV and we're here with Mir Said Bektik. You're now facing Paul Redman on Saturday. What do you think of the change of opponent? It's just a different guy. I mean, uh, yeah, just a different opponent. I mean, nothing's really changed. I mean, my preparation didn't change. Uh, change my, I mean, nothing's really changed for me. Just, uh, just another guy in front of me. So he is, you know, a, an emerging Irish star. Do you feel like there's going to be a lot of eyes on this fight? I mean, I'm fighting, so yeah, there is going to be a lot of eyes, and uh, he's, I guess, has a, a good background as well. So it's going to be, it's going to be an exciting fight, and uh, I'm excited. Uh, and you fight out of American Top Team. Um, how have they been helping you prepare for this fight? Oh man, they've been awesome. I mean, I've been there for three and a half, almost four years. Uh, I train there full time. You know, I take like a week or two break when I'm after my fights, but. I'm there full time. I'm there going with guys like Mike Brown, um, Nick Lenz, Dustin Poirier, Daniel Strauss. I mean, so American Top Team has uh, helped me financially. Is there have helped me with my life and uh, more importantly, my fighting skills. And I'm with the best team in the world, you know, so I'm in good hands. So, what do you know about Paul as a fighter and his style? Well, he's Irish, so he's tough. Uh, yeah, I mean, he's just a well -rounded, he's a well-rounded guy, you know, and uh, he's a tough guy, but uh, like I said, nothing's really changed my outlook. I mean, everybody in the UFC is tough, everybody in the UFC is good, so, I mean, that's, you better be, you better be ready, I mean, yeah, I'm ready, I'm sure he's ready, and you know, the fans are in, are in good hands for a good fight, and I'm, I'm excited. What kind of advantages do you think you might have over him on Saturday? I mean, my, in my world, I'm the best, you know, I'm the best, and... Uh, I believe I'm just a better guy. I mean, that just I mean, I, yeah, I believe in my I'm the best. Not just against him, but not compare myself to him, but any guys, you know, Aldo, you know, I know it's a big statement, but I plan on proving myself with each and every fight. I plan on gaining my respect and that's uh, yeah. You know. So you have your eyes on the belt. Uh, since day one, since I started training, I've always uh, dreamed and meditated on being a world champion. So I've made it this far, so nothing's changed. How long in your eyes do you think it would take you to get there? 217. Beginning of 217. Okay, that's a big statement. Oh. What do you think about the... <laughs> I stay healthy and, you know, nothing good. The guys on my side stay healthy and, you know, that's it. And what do you think about Conor McGregor obviously getting the title shot now against Aldo? I think it's awesome, you know, I think... Uh, I mean, he fought, you know, Dustin Poirier is a teammate of mine, and he beat Dustin, and I know how Dustin, how tough Dustin is and how good he is. So that's, uh, that's uh, I mean, no matter what anybody said, I mean, he fought Dustin, and he beat him. He was ranked number five. So he's right up there, and he fought Dennis Seaver. You know, anybody can say whatever they want, but he fought Dennis Seaver. He's still ranked top ten. And I believe, you know, it's exciting. You know, he's a, he, it's a different kind of character that we're used to seeing. Uh, and I think it's good for the UFC, I think it's good for the sport, and he's earned it, you know, and it's going to be a exciting and interesting style to watch, uh, the two clash. What do you think the outcome would be of that fight? Me personally, I think uh, Aldo's going to win, but it's a fight. Uh, Aldo could have a bad day, I mean, he could have a bad day, it's four ounce gloves, anything can happen. So you're undefeated, um, how do you see that your fight going on Saturday? I mean, I plan on winning, <laughs> you know, that's it, I just plan on winning. Are you going in with a game plan? Uh, my game plan is to win, you know, it's uh, nothing crazy, you know, I just plan on winning. And do you have a prediction for how you may win? Uh, we'll see, <laughs> we'll see. We look forward to seeing that, thank you very much.